video is about learning how to change from uh, decimals to fractions and you know having to go between decimals and fractions percents and fractions decimals and all that stuff gets a little bit crazy and confused but there are some kind of fun ways to kind of help you remember it and also if you really understand what the number means a lot of it just reveals itself so this is a little song that I kind of created and some students added to and kind of helped jazz it up over the years um, it's a little loud and it's a little rowdy. I really like the song. I must say, though, that the teacher who's in the classroom below me, Miss Krasinski, bless her soul. I'm going to dedicate this video to her because she's had to, like, suffer through my class doing this and has to send up little emissaries going, uh, could you guys be quiet? I'm like, oh, sorry about that. So um, <laughs> this is dedicated to Miss Krasinski. Um, so the song goes like this. You may be familiar with it. So it goes like this. Decimals to fractions. Decimals to fractions. Say it, write it, simplify it. Say it, write it, simplify it. Okay, cool little chant. How does it deal with math? So what you're going to do is you're going to look at the you're going to look at the decimal and you've got to change it to a fraction. So decimals to fractions. Now you need to say it, and I'm not saying 2.3. 2.3 is the shortcut, but it unfortunately eludes all meaning and it doesn't help you to change it from a decimal to a fraction. So if you say it in what I call decimal talk, which is the proper way to say it, um, then you actually know how to do it. So say it, two and three tenths, and then you're going to write it, two and three tenths, two and three tenths. And then you're going to simplify it. So I check and I look, does this fraction need to be simplified? No, it doesn't. So I've already changed a decimal to a fraction like that. Wasn't that cool? So once again, decimals to fractions, decimals to fractions, say it, so say it, two thousandths, write it, oops, write it, and then Simplify it. And I always like when I do my simplifying, I look and I see what goes into both of them. They're both divisible by two. So here is a, anytime you divide a number by one, you still get the same answer like five divided by one is still five, six divided by one is still six. Two thousandths divided by a fraction equal to one is still two thousandths. It just looks slightly different. 2 divided by 2 is 1. 1,000 divided by 2 is 500. Okay, and the last one. So why don't you see if you can try that. So you might want to hit the pause button. Try it. And then come back. Okay, so here we are. We're back in action. Decimals to fractions. Decimals to Say it, write it, simplify it. So say it, 35 hundredths. Oopsie, <laughs> that's the write it, <laughs> and simplify it. So both of them are divisible by 5. So 35 divided by 5 is 7. 100 divided by 5 is 20. So that's how you change from a decimal to fraction. So, enjoy. <laughs> and I hope you don't make too much noise when you do it. Or when you do, at least you have a good time and your other friends join in on it. <laughs> Take care.